Hello, welcome to our home. Uh, that would be Princess, but she's busy this week. Um, and I'm the Goo, and this is Gulps and Games, the weekly show where we have some gulps, give a background on it, and then play a game and give like a how to on it. So, uh, sorry you're stuck with just me again tonight. Um, it's the week, like it's our Christmas week. We got all sorts of stuff going on. She had her dance Christmas party last night, her puppet Christmas party tonight, her dad's Christmas party tomorrow, her mom's Christmas party on Sunday, and we're going to go see Spider-Man on Monday. Um, so it's a, it's a busy week, week for us. Uh, and, uh, so I'm, I'm here. Um, Lion is trying to like decide if he wants to be in the video or not. Um, but so I got a nice little treat. Um, I haven't really, I think I mentioned it once in one of our videos and, uh, I, I don't know. I have. I don't really talk to a lot of people. My my close friends and family know, but I got a new job. I uh, I left Zenders and I am an assistant manager at Culver's. Hence the curd nerd hat. I got my hat in the mail. I thought I'd put it put it next to me since uh, just to put some more sp stuff in the space. Um, but also it goes along with uh, the drink. It was uh, a gift from uh, my boss. Um, she uh, she makes this uh, and. Um, it smells delicious, so I'm going to get right into it. Uh, I'm going to probably mispronounce a lot of the words. Because <laughs> I kind of uh, pass Spanish with a D, so uh, that's how good I am with Spanish. But um, this is called uh, Canalazo. Canalazo? Canalazo? <laughs> Uh, it's a hot alcoholic beverage consumed in the Andean highlands of Ecuador, Colombia, Peru, and northern Argentina. Uh, so it's got a, it's got two different uh, history sections: one for Ecuador and Colombia, and one for Peru. I'm going to read them both because Peru's is really small. Um, it also says the country of origin is um, Ecuador and Colombia, considered more so. Um, it typically consists of. Aguardiente, which is sugar cane alcohol, sugar or panea. Panea is a whole sugar cane, and agua de canea, which is water boiled with cinnamon. Uh, Canalazo is traditionally made with homemade aguardiente, but bottled alcohol is also used. There are many variations on the recipe. It is often made with fruit juice, typically naranjilla which uh, is a um, nightshade uh, fruit. It kind of looks like a tomato, um, possibly a tomato mixed with a little orange because it kind of looks thick, thicker like an orange, kind of. Um, very uh, green, like gushy, like tomatoes are on the inside though, and they look like a tomato from the outside. Um, but I think they're more, they're not tomato flavored. Um, I, I've actually seen these before. I think they're a lot smaller than they're looking in the picture. Um, I think these are the ones that are wrapped with, like, the green leaves sometimes you see at cooking shows. Um, Mora, which apparently is just blackberry, so I don't know why they just put blackberry there. Or Marasuya juice, or Maracuya, which is passion fruit. So, again, I don't know, like, I clicked on it, and the link it opens with is, uh, it's passion fruit. It doesn't even mention the, the name. So, um, cloves are sometimes added, and alcohol is sometimes omitted. Now, I could, I could see that, like, it smells like it'd be a great, great little tea. Now, I am smelling a lot of the cinnamon that she has in here. Um, that's a big, fat, like, cinnamon bark. Like, I've never seen cinnamon that fat before. Um, the origins of the drink date back to Colombia, but the drink has long been consumed in the Andes. In Ecuador, the drink is often sold by street vendors during holidays. It is especially pop popular during Fiestas de Quito or Christmas. In 2005, one business began bottling Canalazo without alcohol for export. And then the Peru um, little information says, Canalazo is consumed in the northern highlands of Peru, specifically around Ayabaca in Piura. It consists of aguardiente with sugar or chinaca and cinnamon boiled in water. Lemon and chicha de yora may also be added. Um, I did open chicha de yora and I don't remember what it said. And what was chinaka? Chinaka is sweet sauce made of raw, unrefined sugar. 
and Chicha de Ura is, oh, corn beer. So I, I'm not 100% sure uh, exactly what version this is. I just know this is her version. Um, so let's go ahead and... So this is the liquor. It smells so sweet and strong though too. It's got like a cakey, cakey like cookie like smell to it. Um, I might I might not have enough liquid though to my I might I might not have enough of the liquid. I tried to put half of it in another cup so um, uh, Princess could try some when she gets home. So I might have made it too strong. Smells really good. I'm gonna stir it a little bit, I'll shake it up. Um, I did reheat the liquid that was in the jar. Ooh. Oh god, that's really good. It's like cinnamon. You gotta like cinnamon to like this. It's like I'm drinking like liquid cinnamon. It is really good. Ooh. It is strong, but I, I think it's mixed well. It's just really strong. Um, so, <laughs> I don't have a lot of one-player games around, so... There's not really a connection with this game. I mean, maybe there is. Let me, let me Google it real quick. Guess what? It's popular in Spain and uh, <laughs> Hispanic America. <laughs> it's called Boliche in Spain and Balero in most of Hispanic America. Um, but you know what we like to call it? wooden ball in a cup and see no nope. ball it, the ball is on a rope and attached to the cup nope and I mean this is the game nope let's go ahead nope and see if I can get it in there See how long it takes to get in there. Echo, start a timer. For how long? Stopwatch. Sorry, I don't know that. Echo, start a stopwatch. Sorry, I didn't understand, but I may have a few recommendations. There's a skill called stopwatch. Would you like to try it? Is it free? Stopwatch is rated 3.3 stars by over 2,700 people. Would you like to try it? Yes. Okay, here's Stopwatch. Trying the new Stopwatch. Launch Stopwatch anytime to get the status.
Echo launch stopwatch. Getting stopwatch from Fire TV. She didn't start the top stopwatch. Echo, what time is it? The time is 7.19 p.m. Took me about two Enjoying minutes. It only took me about two minutes. It was 7.17 when I was trying to get her to do the, to do the stopwatch. Uh, but I win! <laughs> that is old-fashioned wooden ball in a cup. The ball is on a rope and attached to the cup. Thanks for coming. Please don't unsubscribe. Please click that subscribe button. We're still trying to reach the number 100. We're still at 56. Um, it just doesn't seem to be going up for 56. Um, <clears throat> that's down over there usually. Um, and uh, you hit the like button if you actually enjoyed this one. Um, I'm not going to use my boss's name, but uh, I'm going to share this in, in the uh, manager chat. Um, I would love some more of this. This is really good. I wonder if uh, Princess is going to like it. She's not a cinnamon fan, but she likes stuff like uh, Fireball. I wouldn't really compare this to Fireball, though. Mm. And uh, thanks for coming. Uh... Cheers.